I kind of came into it without too many expectations. I, I, I knew that we were going to do some service learning and we were going to be working on some murals. I wasn't quite exactly sure what kind of work we were going to be doing. But I was just open to just coming here and trying to see what I can learn, really. On a deeper level, I have several younger siblings that all suffer because I've seen, um, even within their lifespan, like I have a 16-year-old brother who had significantly more art in his life than my six-year-old sister mm -hmm. does going through elementary school. And so I'm able to see the, the downfall of art in education. And I think that it's important. So we're from California. Have you ever been there before? No? Where do you want to go someday? Yeah? So you're a dad? Yes. Yes? No, no, I'm a grandfather. <laughs> That's a dad. I'm a grandfather. Oh, really? Yes. And so what do you think about the mural that's going to be put up here? I think it's a good, good thing for the community, yes. Yeah? Bright, brighten it up. I think it's real good. And what was, was it just this brown wall before? or were It was just a plain brown wall. And now, now I think it, what they're doing here is really conducive to good living. Yeah? Yes. Yes, I do. Um, it's nice helping a different community, but I haven't really done a lot in Marin or even in my hometown in the East Bay. And there's probably plenty of things that I could be doing that I just haven't really found yet. So I guess opening my eyes and seeing things that I could join in on. I remember interviewing somebody about a mural that was in Spanish Harlem, and I remember the woman saying that it reminded her of her family. The people that were depicted in the mural reminded her of her, her own mom and father. And that was really powerful for me, because she told me, what she said was that it reminds the community of where they came from, especially at a time where different people are moving in and out of the community and the community is changing. It reminded the people of that community of their origins, of their roots, and I thought that was really powerful. For me, I think the trip's been a huge success, and I hope all the students feel the same way. And I love working with kids who just feel like they don't have a voice, and it's just really funny to see like when they do something, they painted something, and they can actually show it and be like, I did that, and just walk away like, oh, it's no big deal. And it was just so funny to see kids like get their confidence, or like even yeah. if they already have it, just like to show it in a different way. And I wanted to come here and do that with people. That was just a whole new world here. Well, what I like to see on it, a lot of trees, flowers, you know, something beautiful. Mm -hmm. That's about it. Yeah. yeah. What's wrong? Something beautiful. Yeah. I think that would look nice. And why do you think that the mural would be like good for the kids in the school and and for even just passerby that well, see it? Because any, any anything that's positive with. With education and moving on and, and beautifying your neighborhood, your community, is a good outlook on it. That's what I believe, yes. And it's very true. Very true. And I can see that they're doing this because they're planting trees and everything like that. And they're running out of all the drug dealers and everything. So it's, the neighborhood is coming along. Slowly, but it's coming. And it's a good thing. Yes. Yes, because I remember many years ago this neighborhood was real bad. It picked up a lot. Yes, it did. So what kind of people do you see are trying to make those changes in this neighborhood? Well, most likely the oldest people and, and the teachers that's here at the school, the police department, you know? They're doing, they doing a good job, a real good job. Yes, a real good job. And you think you'll have a fun time playing around this mural with your friends when you see it all finished? Yeah, you excited to see it? <laughs> Girl, a few words. <laughs> I wish she was like that in the house. <laughs>